I'm wondering why you agreed to even do this. Because I like the Atlantic. And also because I kept myself willfully ignorant about what it is that you wanted to do. We wanted to ask the question, is it time to retire this is all real? Good Lord, they're about nothing. It just says, hey, go f yourself. And what if you're vegan, which I'm not? The idea of a sizzle reel sounds to me like bacon on a griddle. I'm Errol Morris, for better or for worse. And this is a film about sizzle reels. Oh, sizzle reels. The sizzle reel is... This is like never an easy question. <laughs> it's eye candy. Quick answer, uh, greatest hits of an agency or a production company. It's definitely one of those things like, yep, yeah, I guess it's been about a year since we've done the last one. My name is... Yeah, I've made a sizzle before. There's a certain style to sizzle reels and there's a certain language that gets used. The sizzle itself has never been reinvented. They're pretty much the same formula every time. Super cutty. Three seconds max, two seconds, one second. Facts. Mixed media. Drone shots, big compelling landscapes. A lot of celebs. Look at this, look at that. Just making statements about their purpose. We do this, we do that. It went viral and then they show like 4,000 weird Twitter mentions of their thing which may or may not be true. You should like us for such and such reasons. And it becomes this sea of sameness. I would say that any given week, I'm working on 15 to 20 sizzles. It's up to kind of like jock jamsy type music that like really gets people pumped up. We are going to play you some music. <laughs> it's so on the nose, it's funny. Not sizzle real music, maybe for a pharma agency. Batman. It's better not to do a sizzle reel than do that. You just f with me now, right? <laughs> no. I went to film school. Anytime we try to make live action only reels, it just seemed like a big disservice to the work. We've done some pretty deep and substantial work. Long form documentary. Machines aren't racist, we are. Deeply reported stories and commissioned original artwork. I just want to give you the possibility to feel. I don't want people to miss the full context of that work. What's the thing you're most proud of? It's about the work. To show the freaking work. Consume the work. Is this useful to you? I feel like this is so desultory and all over the place. I think 